toes to the accessories. Every paint stroke a tribute to the Queen Bee. We're less than two weeks away from Beyonce's concert here in Kansas City, the last stop on her Renaissance tour. And a highly acclaimed local artist is trying to get her attention. KSHB 41's Alyssa Jackson met with Jason Wilcox as he works to get Queen Bee's stamp of approval. When artists like Jason Wilcox creates, there's not a detail missed. I have uh, a few artists in my family. My mother's an artist, um, so she's inspired me to, you know, pay attention to detail. But if you pay attention to several of his pieces, he also channels someone else. But well, my inspiration comes with Jean-Michel Basquiat. From sketching and drawing since he was a child to making it a full-time gig in 2018. That's where the magic happens. Wilcox is hoping the magic is enough to get the attention of a pretty big superstar. I had to stop this and work on Beyonce. He has painted Beyonce, even Jay-Z, six times, and once it landed his artwork in the Nelson Atkins Museum. To have my artwork exhibited at the Nelson is like a dream come true. He is clearly no stranger to having his art displayed on a big stage. His work has also been on the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air spinoff. Will Smith seen my artwork, you know, so, but Beyonce, that's, that's up there. <laughs> At least 100 paintings have come through his garage turned art studio, but he's hoping this artwork doesn't come back after Queen Bee arrives for the last stop on her tour. In other words, it's priceless, so, yeah. you know. Yeah, price that Beyonce. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Wilcox agrees he's living an artist's dream, but having his name in the hands of Beyonce would be another dream come true. A lot of people look up to Beyonce. She's done so much for people, for the communities. Uh, and just inspire people just with her music and just as a mom, as a black mom, as a woman, as you know, so we all love Beyonce. And he wants her to know he will follow instructions when energy comes on. If I ever go to the concert, I promise I'll be mute when I'm supposed to, so. <laughs> In Liberty, Alyssa Jackson, KSHB 41 News.